Families of more than 6,000 sailors and said their heartfelt goodbyes today as the USS Theodore Roosevelt kicked off its deployment. The ship sailed from San Diego today heading for the Indo-Pacific to provide maritime security. News 8's Heather Hope has the farewell from Naval Base North Island. Saying goodbye to family, friends, their favorite foods, and life on land. Thousands of sailors aboard the Theodore Roosevelt packed and prepared for a multi-month deployment. We're always sad to leave. We're excited for the adventure ahead. Sailors aboard the USS Theodore Roosevelt have so much to think about. Uh, a lot. Do I have everything ready? Am I ready? Um, just making sure everything's in order. This will be Patricia Cash Cornejo's very first deployment. She turns 21 years old in 10 days. I know I'll be protected with the people that are going with us, so I'm not too worried. Just a little nerve-wracking because it's my first time. Patricia had her family from Phoenix come see her off. Her mom shed some tears. We have the best Navy in the world, so she'll be good. <laughs> Woohoo! Patricia's best friend, Anthony Torres, will be deployed too, but for his second time. The first deployment was definitely rocky because I didn't bring enough stuff. So. The 26-year-old ship firefighter packed all his favorite foods and games and is expecting. I have a baby on the way, so it's one of the hardest things I've had to do. I didn't have to worry about that last deployment. Some gave long hugs before family got on the 1,000-foot-long ship, longer than the Eiffel Tower, and weighing 100,000 tons. We comprise the most mobile, the most capable, and the most lethal fighting force on the entire planet. Captain Brett Crozier says the Roosevelt is one of our nation's 12 nuclear power aircraft carriers. It will sell the Indo-Pacific to maintain freedom of the seas. We will enhance the security and stability of the entire region, which will benefit our entire country. This family said goodbye with signs, proud of their sailor and sister who is the bomb. We went to boot camp together, but we didn't know it. This couple is no stranger to sad farewells as both parents are in the Navy, now with an eight-month-old baby. It makes it harder. Because, you know, we both know what we're going through. Dad says he'll miss his son Christopher's first birthday. I'm being away from home, and I'll be able to see him growing up. The two besties boarded the ship together as family captured the final moment. A tough day for some children in tears watching the ship go. Mostly nervous because everything that's been going on so far in the news. All in all, I'm pretty sure I'm safe on the ship. The last Theodore Roosevelt Carrier Strike Group was deployed for seven months. It's unclear how long sailors today will be away on this Indo-Pacific deployment.